Hey guys, in this video I'm gonna show you top 10 best recent applications for your Android devices. So the first application on the list is Swipe Home button. So this application has got very useful accents with bezel swipe gestures. For example, you can just swipe up and down to open recent app menu. Just swipe to the right or to the left to pull down the notification menu or swipe up to open any application. So inside the application, you can just see the list of gestures that you can perform. And you can also set a particular action for any particular gesture. So this application works on top of any other application. So this application might be very helpful. So the next application on the list is Thema by My Color Screen. So, so this application brings true one-click theming to Android devices, meaning you can just choose the theme from the list and have it applied on your screen with just a single click. There are various themes that you can choose from, like the GTA 5 and many more, and you can just have it applied on your home screen in few seconds. Just hit the apply button and it will be there on your home screen. There are various themes that you can choose from and many more themes are being added daily. You can just use this application and as any other normal launchers as it has got all the features. You can have custom icon packs, change grid size and many more. So it's one of the best applications to customize your phone and make it look different from others. So the next application on the list is Focal. So it's a fully featured camera app which is made by Cyanogen Mod developers. So in this app, you'll have various advanced features like you can change ISO, adjust color, exposure, and many more. But there are various effects that you can have on your photo. And there are various scene modes included in this camera. This camera application has also got Photosphere and Panorama which you can have in many Android devices. The Photosphere feature works perfectly as well as the Panorama. So that's all about this application. It's the best camera app and it can easily replace the stock camera of your phone. So the next application on the list is Feedly. It's a great news reader application for Android. So the best feature about this application is that it lets you to choose the sources from which you want to receive feeds. There are various categories available and you can search for, for your own. And each category has listed the featured sources which you can add. And you can also add any YouTube channel link so you will be updated with that channel. This application has got a customizable interface letting you to choose between different view modes. Card view list view, magazine view, and full article mode. The design of this application is minimal and it's very easy to use. And with this application, you can easily share any article. Feedly is the best alternative for Google Reader as you can just manage everything you want including YouTube. It's the best news reader application out there as it is fast, free and flexible. The next step here is Dynamic Keyboard. It's a smart keyboard which uses an artificial intelligence algorithm that modifies the key size depending upon the likelihood of next letter. So whenever you tap any letter, the most likely letter size gets increased so that you won't make any mistake. This keyboard really helps you to reduce errors and in this keyboard there are 31 languages available and in the pro version you can also customize how this keyboard looks. This keyboard is very smooth and it looks very nice while typing. The next app here is Repix. So this app has got a wide array of brushes to give your photos an artistic look. It's more than a photo editor. Using the brushes, you can have stunning effects on a photo. This application is very simple and easy to use. With few steps, you can just make your photo look awesome.
Bluepix also has got some editing tools allowing you to control brightness, contrast and saturation. There are many filters included in this application and you can also change the border of the photo. Overall, it's a great application to give final touch to your photos before sharing. So the next application on the list is Avast Mobile Security. Avast is a great security app that has wide range of features. You can schedule automatic scans for the app and the SD card. Two good features of this application are anti-theft and firewall. With firewall, you can disable internet access of any kind of network for a specific application. With advanced features like self-protection and remote settings, you can use a vast online services to track your lost phone and manage it online. Privacy Advisor takes permissions every application needs. The network monitor monitors the data tra traffic. The application management acts as a tax manager. And you also have the application locking option available here. So with this option you can just lock any particular application. And before op opening that application it would require the passcode. The SMS and call filtering can block calls and SMSs for a group of people for specific hours in specific days. The malware detection rate is very good in this application compared with other antivirus applications out there. And all these features are free so it's the best antivirus application out there. The next application on the list is Scope. Scope helps you to manage your social accounts like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr and Reddit. So in Scope, you can add your social accounts as well as various news feeds. So you can view your social feeds as well as latest news all managed at a single place. There are messaging options available in this application so you can chat with your friends on Facebook. Uh, it's a fully featured application as it allows you to chat with your friends, say, like, comment and do all the other things. So this application is a great way to organize your internet activities all at a single place. The next application on the list is, is it's a multitasking application which helps you to access quick settings, toggles and switch between recent applications. There is also a music player in it. Uh, uh, so it's easy for you to control music from anywhere. So this multitasking window opens wherever you are. It opens on top of any application. So you can access all these items very easily. Uh, and you can also change all the items in this box. You can add various dog. You can just add various toggles and quick settings that you want. You can also add buttons like home button menu button so if your phone doesn't have any dedicated buttons you can just use this application and there are many other settings that you can change like the color of the application transparency level and you can also choose the side from which you want this application to work so the last application on the list is night mode so what this application does is that it lets you to lower the brightness of your phone below the limit of your phone. So sometimes the lower limit can be very bright at night times while browsing or watching a video or reading a PDF file. With this application you can just make the brightness of your screen very low. So this application can come handy sometimes. So that's all about this application. So that wraps up the video. So if you know of any other applications just comment below and to subscribe for more videos if you like this video just click the thumbs up button below and do like us on facebook and twitter the links are below in the description box so thanks for watching have a nice day